Change. Change is on my mind. It's not always easy as it seems. Change. From one state to another. You do different things differently than most times, right? Change. <gasps> well. Lately, I've been drinking these. It's just water. Full of water. Tons of them. I drink them. Water. I have cups and cups and cups and cups of water. Even a bottle that can measure how much water I'm drinking. This is 32 ounces of water. Even have one of these. So the longer it is, the more water I'll get. But thing is, I drank so much that I had to buy more. <sighs> we gotta go to get some more, right? Change. What can I change? Yesterday, I found out <clears throat> that I have had two diabetes. I'm diabetic. For years, I was getting through the cracks, you know. I was like, um, no high cholesterol, everything's normal. All you have is high blood pressure. Doctors scratching their heads, saying, you're obese. You don't have this and you don't have that. And I'm thinking to myself, well, thank you. I guess I was doing right. And then a couple months, I don't know, I just started giving up. Cause just, just for out of the blue, I decided it'd be good to, you know, lose weight. And so I started eating. Um, I moved out when I was 27 to my grandmother's house, and I started eating, like, Ground turkey, salmon, chicken breasts, and I'll have a salad, then I'll have my pasta and rice, and doing all that stuff, but everything was going fine, you know, but I was still getting weight, but I wasn't getting to the diabetic part, I wasn't getting diabetes, and then now, fast forward, I'm 33, moved out of my other apartment, I was living for four years, and I decided, I don't give a crap. I don't want anything. Everything's going great, you know. I'm not getting high cholesterol and doing this and that. So I can eat what I want, you know. So I got sick of, you know, ground turkey. Got sick of chicken. Got sick of um, eating fish. And then I started doing tilapia. And then I got sick of it. So I started getting white, red, white bread and white rice. Then I went to ground turkey. Not ground turkey. <laughs> Get that out of my mouth. It was um, beef. Ground beef. It was so greasy. It was big. Big old package of beef. It was so good. And um, then I started going walking down the street. And there was a, a burger restaurant. I started eating burgers and burritos. And I lived next door to 7-Eleven. So I started eating 7-Eleven snacks, chips, and ice cream. And then, <laughs> bam! You have diabetes. Just because I made a simple little crazy change from eating turkey fish and chicken and tilapia and salmon and I'm thinking like just because I made that little change I get diabetes so guess what I gotta go back to the original plan it's moderation eating my salad you know I can still have my snacks and goodies but not as much as I've been doing you know carelessly eating you know drinking juice Gatorade, and it is doing all kinds of crazy stuff, but I'm going to just do what I was been doing and go back to the routine. You know, I was exercising more often and I'm getting myself in order. But anywho, whatever. Just got to get it together, right? Oh, lovely change. So, what am I going to do? The room's a mess. I decided I'm going to start, I gotta take this crazy medicine, <sighs> more pills, right when I thought I was getting rid of pills, I gained a pill, and it said I'd take it at night, it's metformin, 
take one tablet by mouth every evening. Tablet extended release. Huh? Usually they tell you what it's for. They didn't tell you what it's for. It's like daily with your evening meal. Take, take this. Take it in the evening as directed. Do not crush or do not do not crush or chew before swallowing. Well, I don't want to. Ugh. Nasty, anyways. But yeah. So I have this um, vision board I created, and I'm thinking like, okay, that's nothing to do with my health, but I'm gonna add some more stuff because I wanna be skinny, slim, not skinny, healthy, fit. Add some more veggies in my life. Um, it's not gonna be easy, I know, because I love burgers and love French fries. But there's ways of doing it. They said you can bake it, boil it, don't fry it, just bake it, boil it, steam it. I was doing so good, y'all. And then one day I just got off the kick. I said, screw this diet. You know, it can't be a diet. That's a part of it. You can't be a diet. And I got sick of the routine, you know, turkey, fish, chicken. <sighs> and then, there it is. Then I'm back to turkey. I'm back to turkey. And turkey's good. You know, maybe season it. You know, it's the way it's, it's ground turkey. It's like, it's like beef, but... A little more leaner, like a Jenny old kind. And, um, but anywho, change. You gotta change. Well, I gotta change. I don't know about you. And I got up to 270, y'all. I'm like, no. Nah. This is the biggest I've ever been. I'm huge. Yeah, I got it. Well, you can't really see this in the night, but I'm huge. I got up to 270. And I'm like, 270. I was like, hoping it was like 260. No, 270. This is the heaviest I've ever been. And I'm. I was crying out a couple a couple months ago, and then I didn't. I wasn't even there yet. I was borderline diabetic. Now they say, "Oh, now you're in it," and this is what's gonna happen. I'm like, no. They had a doctor tell you. There's some things you're gonna change because this is some things you gotta do. But they don't wanna like say it like that. But they give you like the whole. Right now she says, "Starts in your feet, then you're gonna get amputated, and then something might happen to your heart and in your brain. You know, gets confused and you have a stroke." It's looking like, oh my god, something's gonna change. I just go back to what I used to do, you know, exercising, walking around, and eating moderation of certain sorts of variety of foods that don't include in fat and grease. I know the greasy food make me stomach hurt, anyways. And pork, I like pork sausages. It tastes tastes good, but after a fact, my stomach starts hurting, and I can't eat a lot. It's like, why not eat out anyway? Eat at home. I know how to cook. <laughs> Change. That's all I gotta say. 